Well, for more perspective, we're joined by former Greek finance minister Stefanos Manos. Stefanos, thanks so much for joining us. Uh, the Syriza government has been arguing that the Greek economy is marking a strong recovery, and then others are saying that the only thing growing is actually the black market uh, as Greeks try to avoid paying these unrealistically high taxes that were implemented under the Syriza government. Which is it? Well, the second is certainly true. There is a growing black market as people try to avoid uh, insurance premiums and the extremely high uh, tax taxation. So it stands to reason that many people are, are going into the black market in growing numbers. So there is an unrecorded element of the economy uh, growing. So everybody makes or estimates, but we don't know exactly what's happening. I don't know exactly what's happening. Okay, then what are you expecting uh, from this meeting? It's probably not going to reach, they're, they're probably not going to reach an agreement, unfortunately, because each time they don't reach an agreement and they postpone the agreement, uh, the next time, the terms, the next time will be more difficult than this time. Uh, this has been the pattern every time. Uh, what, what is now at stake? is that the creditors, uh, in order to agree, demand additional measures. Greece does not want to accept additional measures. Next time, the additional measures are going to be even more additional measures. In the end, Greece will have to accept them, and it's going to be worse than the ones they would have accepted now. So that's more or less uh, how it looks. So do you foresee uh, this debt repayment crisis uh, taking place as early as July? Well, I would hope that it will happen earlier, but uh, one never knows because, uh, A, the government is not always uh, reacting rationally. We've seen that before. And, B, there is also the element of what the public opinion says. Public opinion is becoming more and more volatile as it's, it's fed up. I mean, it's, you know, after seven years of austerity, it's really fed up with everything. So uh, it has seen all, all forms and sorts of governments fail. So they're really fed up with everyone. They don't want anything. They'd like something different. And we've seen how this uh, turns up in other, in other places. I mean, the, the, the anti-establishment kind of reaction, which does not stand to reason or logic, but it happens. And this is the danger in this case in Greece. Okay. Former Finance Minister Stefanos Manos, thank you so much for joining us there.